Recipe Busy Mom Fat Loss Expert and author of several different Fit Yummy Mummy fat loss resources designed exclusively for busy moms to help them get an even better body after having a baby. And we are in the throes of back to school season. I uh, wrote a little bit of an article about this, about still feeling like this is rough draft month, feeling out good routines exploring ideas for new rituals, especially a new morning ritual, in order to help make things run more smoothly, try to manage levels of stress, and to keep everybody happy and healthy at the same time. As a busy mom, I mean, we have so many things to juggle. And this is a transition for us because our routines are now different than our summer schedules. Uh, it is especially different for our family because now Tyler is a big old seventh grader and Alexander is going to three-year-old preschool two mornings a week versus one like last year and it's an extra hour. So now I'm having to plan meals around their schedules. Alexander is at it, not at all like his brother Tyler who is open to eating anything. He's extremely picky. So we've had to go through an exploratory process of finding out what he will eat for snacks and school lunches. Uh, so knowing that I face my own challenges. I wanted to present the question to you, what are your biggest back to school concerns or challenges from waking up early, the morning rush, prepping, making, packing, healthy snacks and meals, stress, bedtime, super busy schedules with school activities, organization or lack of, homework, and what about family quality time? So what I'd like you to do is leave a comment below and share what those challenges are. And together, I will come up with some strategies to share with you to help make that transition a little bit more doable. Because we know nothing's ever easy. It's just more doable. And what I want to do is, because um, this is kind of like a tradition every year, we do a back-to-school video. And it's really neat to see how the boys have grown. All right. All right, boys, I need your help. All right, first of all, it's, it's just kind of... Yep, you need to come closer. I've got them. All right, so first of all, if anybody watched last year's video, if you could just notice the height difference. And this one, ener oh yeah, did, but there is a yawn. This one, energy level is nonstop. No more naps. So, okay, but mom's talking. Remember, we're gonna, I'm going to ask you a question. So, Alex, I'll start with you. What is your favorite part about school? Um... Going to the playground play with Keaton. <coughs> with Keaton. I love it. Uh, mm -hmm. So it's easy for me to ask him what his favorite part is because Alexander wakes up, his eyes aren't even open, and he's like, I'm like, guess what today is? I'm like, school day. And he's like, school! He's so excited, and he likes picking out his own clothes and getting all dressed up and everything. Then this guy, Tyler, is going to be a teenager this, this fall. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know, it's okay. He's still going to be Tyler. He's just getting older, and that's all right, because you're getting older too, right? So my question to Tyler is, what is your biggest back-to-school challenge? Waking up early. Yeah, waking up early. I think that's hard for almost everyone. <laughs> this one would sleep, but he, knowing that he's so excited about school, he jumps out of bed. Whereas this guy, it takes him a while to kind of stretch and get ready. Uh, so we're still feeling out different things that work for us. I think our morning routine is pretty efficient. You feel good about your mornings? Yeah. Yeah? We run, is, ha, am I late getting you to school anymore? No. The reason why I asked Tyler that is because my nickname used to be Ladybug. And, <laughs> and now when mom's running late, it only causes, it's not only causing her stress, guess who else it's stressing out? <laughs> the kids. So Tyler came up with the idea of mom. When you know that you have to be somewhere, what are you thinking about? How did you say that? How, how did you ask me that? Uh, are you thinking about getting there on time or getting there early? Aha. Uh -huh. So my reply is, well, get, bless you. <laughs> my reply was, well, getting there on time, duh. And he was like, what did you suggest? Let, shh, let Tyler make his suggestion. Uh, I said that um, if you focus on get there on time, then there's a better chance of you being late and then focus on getting early. It made perfect sense. And ever since I adopted his suggestion, his strategy, we are never late. Now I'm thinking about getting there early. And if something does happen, at the very least, we're on time. 
So that's something that my child had to teach me as a busy mom. So with this new back to school se uh, season, this is a restart for many families, for many busy moms, kind of feeling out um, what types of new routines and rituals need to be in place. So please leave a comment below. Tell me, tell us what your concerns and challenges are. And I'm sure I can get some help. I'll share my strategies, but I mean, this guy's pretty smart. Um, and this guy's pretty funny. <laughs> I mean, he's pretty smart too. I'm sure that I can ask for these guys' input on what they're doing that works so the kids can also have someone to connect to so it's not just a mom yapping about what, what you need to do to have a good system in place. What do you want to tell me? I don't know why I'm laughing because, because I said, I'm going to have to do something because I'm crazy. All right, go ahead and leave a comment below. I'll be looking forward to your reply. See ya.